Okay, we're walking out here to the Monaco. It's an oldie, but it's a goodie. You ever heard that one before? Oldie, but a goodie. It's a diesel pusher. There are no slides, but it's a 1990 Monaco. And we're gonna walk around it. Now we're gonna get in and look around it, look in it. And if you are furtherly interested, I highly suggest you come and preview. I'm not saying it won't drive from here to New York, but you know, that way you look at it in person. There's no other questions. Everything seems to be okay on it. I have not tried the water, the hot water heater, or anything like that. We're assuming it works. The gentleman that brought it in said they just haven't used it in like a year, so they're gonna get rid of it. So that is the deal. Um, I, will, I know we have, or we will have some pictures of the motor and everything. I think they already did those. If not, we'll get them on there shortly and tell you what it is and the size of it. We just wanted to get it on as quick as we could here for everybody to start looking at it. Uh, the tires are definitely weather cracked. So if you're planning on driving at home, I'm sure it'll make it a ways, but I wouldn't go too far in this heat these days because you might have a blowout front ones look to be brand new so um, what else can I tell you as the awning we didn't pull it out to see how it is but it looks like it's in a cover so it should be good automatic door step works good all wood floors I'm gonna kind of do this quick because we do have still shots of everything Got the shower right there, sink, nice mirrors, nice back bedroom here, TV up there. Um, the throne right there. So I guess if you want, you could take a shower and almost go to the bathroom at the same time. Uh, two nice couches, look at that leather nice kitchen area nice microwave oh hmm that's kind of a different oh well, i guess you would put a chair right here pretty neat here's all the controls generator give it a preheat. I haven't even checked this, so let's check it. 741 on the generator. Oh, almost. There it goes. And it is green and it is running. Sounds really good, too. Not sure where it is, but let's go find it. Right in the front. Nope. Maybe on the side. So it's probably right. Nope. It's somewhere up in there. It's not there. Hmm. Oh, there's the exhaust for it right there. It must pull out right here. Let's see. No, I can't. I don't. Oh, wait. Wait, let's check. Oh, well. Must be a trick to it. There's a trick to it, I'm sure. There's a trick to everything. Sounds good, though. Let's go back in, fire it up, show you it goes forward and reverse. We'll be good. Generator's running. Let me 
shut it off. Okay. Come up here to the commander's pilot station here. Look like you're a pilot. Okay, so here we go. Let's fire it off. It's air brakes. So be ready for that. I uh, parked it here probably an hour ago and it's still holding air well. So that's good. That's a good sign. Um, there's the passenger seat over there. Nice little table. Got the rear camera right there. Let's see if the air works. It's blowing. We'll see if it gets cool while we're here. Because it is very warm today. Mileage looks to be 215,206. 215,206. Probably the most miles I've seen on a motorhome. Most people don't ever use them, but this one looks like it got used. Good oil pressure. It's pounding oh, almost 60 pounds. Um, well, the air's pretty cool, actually. So that's all good. It's looking good. All right, so here's the brake control right here. Press it. You got all this other stuff here. Airbag release. So you can drop your air if you want. It is on air ride. Put it in reverse. Make sure we're not going to hit anybody right off the bat. Reverse works well. Brakes are good. Now we're going forward. Oh wow, this baby is responsive. Whoa! Oh, I forgot to shut the door. Scared me. All right, so it appears to go really good uh, forward, and it went good backwards. We'll try it one more time. Yeah, sounds good. So I see a little warning stuff here. It says shift to neutral when you're setting the air brakes. Set brakes when stopped. Don't accidentally hit it while you're moving. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so that is the video on the motorhome. Um, I don't know how long it is, but it appears to be like 30, oh, I don't know, 35 feet probably. Maybe 36. I'm going to get it backed in to where it needs to be here. And to do that, I'm going to have to get off of here. Just set the brake. Everything looks good. It's charging. A lot of air. Oh, look at that. Good oil pressure. Blows out some nice black smoke when you punch it. Very responsive. I think we got a good one here. Okay, that's it. The air's still blowing, so I think we're good to go. Thanks for watching, and I don't know if these work or not. I'm looking at the fans here. I'm sure they do. Let's see if we can find them. Let's see. They always say you're taking too long. Oh, that one over there works. Let's see if this one. Oh, yeah. Now you're talking. This is back in the day you used to have these. See? Look at that. Isn't that funny how they turn like that? It's going full speed ahead, and I put that on, and it looks like it's barely turning. Huh. Oh, uh, yeah. You're going to be cool up front here, I'll tell you right now. It's got a CB also if you want one. Yeah. You can hate good buddy it. All right, that's it. Gotta go. See you on the next one.
go ahead if you want a preview it's going to be on june 2nd nine to four come on down here and you can check it out in person and the auction starts june 3rd at seven o'clock in the evening so be ready thanks a lot bye bye